how are you doing today? Oops, I should probably be a bit higher. What's up? What's up? What's up? How are you doing? Yes, yo, yo, Tink. What's up? How are you doing? Look, I wore our jersey because we need all the help we can get, man, for this Sunday. I won't even lie. <laughs> I can't even lie. Um, let me just plug this in. So, um, before everybody else comes in, bruv, as much as I don't like Arsenal and I want to just clown them, I'm going to be real, man. Um, yeah, they're better than us right now. <laughs> they're better than us right now. So, um, yeah, <laughs> we could be. It could be a long day. I can't lie, especially with those Arsenal fans. I, I'm, I'm not going to tell the Arsenal fan this. No way. No way. I'm not telling the Arsenal fan this. But I swear to God, man, I, I'm not looking forward to this Sunday. I swear, we are trash, bro. <laughs> like, we are actually so bad. Like, if this was a Champions League game. If this was a Champions League game, I'd have more hope. But because it's Prem, no way. <laughs> no, Premier League and Chelsea don't go hand in hand. I don't know why, but it just doesn't. But anyway, how, how's everyone doing today? Uh, Darth Deku, what is good? What is good? Um, updates from me. Not really much has changed apart from the fact that um, I'm alive, I guess. I've been doing more errands lately because like stuff's been happening in my life. Um, hold on. Zakaria needs to start. Zakaria, yeah. Zakaria needs to start as soon as possible. Like, as soon as he's match fit, he needs to be starting games. Because, bro, like... Sorry, I have to go on a Chelsea tangent for, like, a couple seconds here. But, bro, Zakaria is everything we needed in a midfielder, bro. Like, we literally needed... Like, we said, hey, we need a strong presence who can just collect the... Win, just win the ball back, bro. And just connect the attack. And maybe score some goals. He did everything in one game, bro. <laughs> everything I asked for in one game. So... I need him to start starting like soon because he will save us so much money. Like, you know why. You, you know why. You know the, the, the there's rice at home. You know why. But anyway, um, my hero has been fire so far and the anime has been absolutely incredible. The last that episode, um, obviously we speak literally a week after the episode is aired. Uh, Zakara is beginning. It's literally yes and no. He is. I know what you're saying because I agree with you. He does have a lot of Kante's attributes. I would say the difference is i would say kante's um energy is probably higher well, his work rate's probably higher and his tackling's probably better and um but and his dribbling's probably better but zakaria i would say he could shoot so that was also instantly better than like kante don't shoot like that he, he could shoot um and he's stronger and he's more of a presence so i basically what we what we need from kante now is kind of what zakaria could probably can provide so that's why i see what you're saying but i don't know um that's why I, it's, it's a hard one to say is bigger kante but i know what you're saying i know what you're saying but yeah the anime has been absolutely incredible shigaraki's decay scene i already said this all in my review and everything so you probably know but i want to hear your opinions of it um shigaraki's decay scene was incredible i've watched literally i watched the episode again yesterday like i've watched this episode three times <laughs> and i've watched that decay scene at least like 10 times at least 10 like i rewatched the whole the kc stuff i'm happy with season six i just hope the second core is as good as the first it is solo as De deku so i assume they'll do justice i know what you're first hi tyler that's the first thing i need to tell you and i know what you're saying i i get it like they usually save their budget for like the first core the first core is where the budget really goes like that's where it usually really goes like last season that trading arc as much as right i i hate i i um trash season five trading arc was actually really good I, I let's be real the animation was insane of that okay it's just the rest of it was just mid so um so there's that but um so that's why i'm a little bit worried that's Darth Deku. Sorry, Darth Deku. Why did I say that? I'm, I'm worried that Deku, Villa, Deku Dark Arc is going to be... It's not going to have that much animation. But I, now that I think about it, how many fights does Deku really have? I mean, he fights Nagant. He fights Muscular. He fights 1A. That's it. And then maybe Stars and Stripes. Correct me if I'm wrong. I, I can't think of another fight in that period apart from them three. So those are where you really need the animation. It's not like the War Arc where you need the animation like almost every episode. So... We could get away with it, actually. It could probably bang. It probably will bang. Because one a, guaranteed 1A will have the sexiest animation. Like, guaranteed 1A versus Deku. Oh, guaranteed. Uh, Muscular will have pretty sweet animation, I'd say. Actually, do you know what? I'm going to have faith. If they can animate a female Nobu <laughs> so damn well, I think they're going to animate the fights as well, actually. Because that Nobu run, oh my god. That female Nobu run, I couldn't believe it when I saw it in the last episode. Was it episode? No, it was the last episode. I couldn't believe it when I saw it. I was like, what? 
Like, bro, nah, that episode was crazy. Have you seen the leaked images for this week's episode, bro? Shiggy got rainbow eyes. It's like, ooh, he got rainbow eyes with a such quirk. Ooh, that's cold. That is cold. I can't wait to see that. I actually can't wait to see that. But the one I saw was obviously, I've seen the PV. So I saw the Shiggy jump. I knew Bones would animate the crap out of that Shiggy jump, bro. Because when I saw it in the manga, I said, Bones is going to, like, I, I, I basically, when I read that in the manga, I imagined, do you remember when Bakugo escaped, um, escaped, uh, what was the name of the city now? It's not, it's not Hosu. Is it Hosu? No, it's not Hosu. But basically, where he escaped, um, won um, AFO and all the League of Villains. And that cut in the anime, the Sakuga, was ridiculous. I was expecting that for Shiggy. But they did something completely different. They powered him up from the bottom. But I think they're going to still do that flight thing with that they did with Bakugo in the anime. But I'm excited. Episode 5. Oh, oh th- no, not episode 5. What was it? Episode 6? This episode is going to slap, man. We're getting that. Shigaraki searching for one for all. Mentioning one for all. Plus fighting Endeavor. Plus he's going to deck Endeavor and do the pose. Oh, what an episode. Um, Deku fights um, like two to three other villains that is off screen, but it's off screen. Oh, yeah, that's true. He does. He does. Because when he's chasing um, AFO in it, he goes on like a literal villain hunt. So you've got a point there. Do you think they animate that, Tyler? I wouldn't be surprised if they do. I think, actually, no, no, I take that back. I think they're going to slide, they're either going to slideshow swipe it or they're going to give you the animation of the Deku punch maybe before they get taken down. Like, for example, I know there's one villain that gets hung up when Deku's, like, black whipping him. Like, I don't expect us to see how that guy got beaten. I expect to just see the aftermath of that one because that impact was hard in the manga and it would probably be the same in the anime. But we'll wait and see. Um, filler episode for the shark villain Deku fight. Um, filler episode for the shark villain Deku for... Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! I remember. I forgot about that. I remember seeing that panel. I was like, whoa, what a fight. Why didn't we see this <laughs> fully? Because that scene looked bad. Nah, they're going to slideshow swipe it. I swear. They're going to slideshow swipe it. Just don't raise your hopes up, t- t- Tink. They're going to slideshow it. They're going to slideshow that one 100%. No way a female nobody gets more love than Nagan. Bro, in it. Bro. Bro, that female, literally, I, I, I think I need to remember that female Nobu scene for any time I lose faith in scene being animated well because that female Nobu run did not need to happen. It didn't, but it did, and it was sexy animation. So there's no way they're not going to animate Nugget doing well. They can't, they can't. They surely, surely they have to animate that well. Uh, the shark villain and the other assassin Deku off screen by the, by the time All Might pulled out. I know, like this, this, this actual, now that I think about it, you guys are right. There are actual villains that Deku fought in the arc. It, it literally, when it was going on a villain hunt. But, but will time like I? I know Deku is the main protagonist, and I know they want to give Deku as much shine as possible. But do you think with the time constraints they have, they're going to spend that time animating these fights? That's the thing, especially with pacing as well. You don't want that pacing to turn into butt if you start animating all these fights. But we'll wait and see. It is possible to get them animated and put in pacing, but I don't know. I don't expect Bones to try that hard if that makes sense i mean maybe i'm wrong but wait and see um that jump from shigaraki was raw raw as f- i'm trying not to swear <laughs> but you know what i mean raw as hell raw as hell this episode gonna head halfway through a chapter uh which one if i was to guess if i was to guess i think the episode ends when deku says hey endeavor um shigaraki's looking for me i mean correct me if i'm wrong but that's what i think um that i believe that was like let me think. The first chapter, Shigaraki goes to Deku, one for all. Then Endeavor, when he fights Shigaraki, here's the one for all. Deku now leaves. Um, yeah, I I think at the end of the episode... Oh, wait, no. Actually, I tell a lie. It might go further than that. It might go further than Deku saying, hey, he's looking for me, actually. I, got, I, I might be wrong. Um, I hope they show it because one episode of Deku beating ass would hit bro. It would, I won't lie, it would. <laughs> it really would. That, that could be a baller episode. You can see Deku just get depressed and depressed and depressed per fight. It really could slap. I won't lie. So I can't wait. Um, it is chapter 317 or 318 where we see Deku fighting, hanging some. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Um, I remember that. But three, wait, was that 317? Hold on. Oh, no, you're right. You're right. The arc ended around the 320s, isn't it? I think it ended around like 320 or so. Okay, because I think that's when the Stars and Stripes fights happen. You're right, you're right, you're right. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So um, we're, we're a long time away, and just Stars and Stripes animated is going to be six. 
I, I, I really can't wait for Stars and Stripes. I really can't. But if I'm Bones, I save that for the first episode of Season 7. Imagine starting off Season 7 with the Stars and Stripes fight. Bro, like that is, if that doesn't sell your anime, I don't know what does. Because the way Season 6 started was hard. And it's not even like the hardest thing you could probably start a season with in My Hero, if, if that makes sense. Like, bro, starting with Stars and Stripes... Ooh, <laughs> but but I feel like uh, I forgot who said it. I think it was Tink that said this two 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 episodes two two um live streams ago that Stars and Stripes will probably be at the end of season six, and I wouldn't be surprised. Um, well, Deku Far From Home, <laughs> I love that Deku Far From Home would have a span of twelve to ten episodes, so maybe I think it has a span of ten. I think it's gonna be like um, like what arc was it? There was an arc. That was meant to be, oh, right, I remember, like, uh, joint training. No, not joint training, pro license arc. You know how pro license arc was most of the season, but it wasn't really most of the season. It was the last, like, two or three episodes that was, like, the start of Overhaul. I'm expecting that from Villain Hunt. I'm not even going to lie. Um, maybe seven. Uh, maybe seven. What? Oh, maybe season seven for Stars and Stripes? Yeah, I agree. It never stops happens after the war. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that is true. That is true. There's an episode for Dabi. There's an episode for Dabi. I've almost forgot about that. There's an episode for Dabi. I forgot Stain drops in. There is a lot of stuff that actually, ooh, Tyler, you might be right, you know. A lot of stuff happens in that villain hunt. I almost forgot. A lot of stuff does happen. Um, I think it'll end with, um, it might end with Aizar telling Shiggy not to touch his students. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, the episode. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, 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 that makes sense. The next episode, yeah, yeah, yeah that makes sense. Uh, chapter two, seven, uh, seven, six. Okay, after this last Tink one down here, I'll start reading chapter because, sorry, I, I, I like talking to you guys. That's why I read these comments. Uh, chapter two, seven, six, um, and and okay, so the chapter two seven six, the panel uh before we see Shiggy on top of Endeavor is where we're gonna end. You think it ends then? Ooh, that would be rude. I mean, it would be sweet to end it then, but that would be rude, bro. Imagine end it. Ah, actually, actually, because Shiggy has to search for Deku first, then Endeavor drops in. Actually, no, no, I tell a lie. No, 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 no. I tell a lie. I'm wrong. Doesn't Endeavor drop in ASAP? I'm pretty sure Endeavor drops in ASAP. Like, as soon as the episode starts, I'm pretty sure Endeavor's rocking up. Hmm. Okay, Tink. And then because the image leaks for next week's episode are at the end of 276. Okay. All right. Do you know what? That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. Also, shout out to the animators giving Crust and Excess more screen time. They gave Crust more screen time. They gave Excess more dying time. All right. <laughs> That's what happened. They gave Excess more time to die. Because <laughs> the way he got killed by Shigaraki was bad. All right. So, 372 is what we're going to do. Uh, re react to the last episode was. The um, BLM arc, I, I realize I can't really say the R word, so I have to use a different word. Um, what's up, Madman? What's up, Floor? We well, you just scraped it just as I was about to start the reaction, so you just scraped it. But, um, but yeah, what was I gonna say? So, last chapter, we got the BLM arc. I've been loving it so much. Um, the BML, hold on, uh, I need a break, also break this. Oh, no, oh, I'm not gonna see you guys. And you know what's funny? The week I'm not gonna see you guys is like God of War and Black Panther week, actually. Yeah, it's God of War Black Panther week, isn't it? It's next week. That's bad. Oh, no. <laughs> that's sad. Oh, well. I mean, we'll see each other the week after, but that's kind of sad. I love I love speaking to you guys. Like, it's, it sucks when it get these breaks. I'm not going to lie. But anyway, Exus Lasers with the Nobu Slowly Awakening was the... Okay, it was. It was. It was. It was. I won't even lie. It was. It was. It was. It was. It was. Um, okay. So, chapter 272. We already know. BLM Uh, Let's just move on, I guess. So... I'm going to forget names and it's going to annoy me. Who's behind Shoji again? Koda. Koda is behind Shoji. Okay, no. Koda. Got it. Koda is behind Shoji. Right. Shoji goes, please dispatch us to protect the central hospital. Right. This chapter leaves on a cliff cliffhanger. Ooh, I'm excited. I'm excited. Hold on. God of War comes out on a birthday. Good. Oh, happy birthday in advance. And it seems like you're going to have a masterpiece on your birthday. Everyone's saying that the reviews are ridiculous. I can't wait to play that game. And another thing, let me know. I'm um I'm definitely gonna do a review for the game. I might see if it's possible to do gameplay. I've got a lot of like I've got the stuff to record it. I've just not tried it. That's why I'm like Ugh. I don't know if I should be like, oh it's a definite, but let me know if you want that. I'm probably I, I might do that. I don't know. Um it depends. So also this chapter leaves a good okay, okay, Yeah, I need a gym god of war. I can't oh, bro. I want I, I want Japan, bro. I actually mm, 
let's save Japan. Let's go to Egypt next. Actually, you're right. I, I think we should save Japan because I know this Egypt Japan. Um, the teasers from the first game was uh, obviously Roman, uh, which we've already done. Um, they did Norse. I think it was Egypt Japan. I, correct me if I missed one. So I want to do Egypt first. Japan can come later. We can save Japan. Japan will make you bread. Like, go on. Let's save Japan. Let's do Egypt next. Um, yeah. Ditto, in it. Have you read the chapter? Okay, sorry. Let me finish doing the chapter. So <clears throat> please dispatch us to protect the central hospital. I'm literally at the beginning, right? Then Aizawa and All Might are looking. They were like, why is Shoji and um, Koda asking that? So, oh, Jesus. Uh, I missed that. Uh, how do you guys know about that? Okay, so it's meant to be a secret. We haven't told any of the students yet. And then Shoji said, the lady, the giant lady came to talk to me about some things and I asked her about the outside world. I went around and asked other refugees too. And he goes, oh, giant lady. Oh, that's what All Might says. <laughs> giant lady. She doesn't she have a name. I swear she has a name. Anyway, I can't remember her name though. Um, I, re I can't remember the hero name though. Remember that picture of Nagan and, uh, well, I guess giant lady, that, that picture. Anyway, so the mutants received a call to action and many of them are headed to the hospital. If Shoji's going, I want to go too, said um, Koda. So, <laughs> okay. If I let this side, I would be able to call myself a hero, says Shoji. Boom. <clears throat> Chapters called Naked. I wonder why. Aizo is looking, closes his eyes. He goes, all right, I guess so. Aizo goes, leaking false information about his location wasn't enough to fool the enemy. And then present Mike is also a bit sad. And then he goes, Yamada, sorry, they need your support. Aww. You already know this, Aizo sensei, but quirks get stronger in each generation. These kids, and look at him, he goes, huh? already far stronger oh and yeah that's the thing i love about my hero the quirks do get stronger for a generation so seeing this bro those kids by the way sorry I, this is a bit, a bit of a tangent but those kids that bakugo and shoto uh taught um Spaka, shoto kb and what's his name Inasa taught they're gonna be monsters fam <laughs> they're, they're scared me bro they're gonna be monsters so yeah anyway so they say these kids are already far stronger than any of us that were, were back when we people called us three idiots. Aw. And uh, then look at Koda. Bro, he's looking like a Superman, bro. Look at him with his horn and his hand up. Ugh, I got the power. Bro, look at Koda go, right? Oh, Ko <sighs> okay, Koji. Sorry, said the wrong name. Whatever, man. Anyway, he goes, Koji, one day, um, one day you may also grow horns. Those horns allow our feelings to reach the animals even if they're far away. Oh, interesting. That's cool. You see, people have always said mean things uh, to me because of the way I look. But your daddy got an angry at them. He said, don't worry. Don't you dare laugh at her beautiful horns. Aww. Koji, you should follow these steps. Okay? Become an adult who gets angry when people laugh at someone you care about. He goes... Hitchcock! Shoji goes, Octo! Octo! Expansion birds! Boom! Okay, sorry. It's Hitchcock birds and um, Octo expansion. But these hits are sexy. Boom! Boom! Oh, Jesus! Oh, sugar! Prison Mike... Wait, wait. What did he hit? Oh, did he get... Wait a minute. Did he get spinner from the side? Hold on. No, 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 no. That doesn't make sense. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So... Koda did his thing. Ko okay, Koda or Koji? I don't know why I forget his name. Koda did his thing, right? Um, I thought it was Koda. Wait, is it Koji? Whatever, man. He did his thing. Um, Shoji did his thing, right? What did President Mike hit? What was he going to... What did he hit? <sighs> Whatever. I'm going to assume he's he hit Spinner. I can't really tell what he hit, but we'll, we'll come... We'll, it'll end up... It'll be explainable. Anyway... Okay, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I see. So, from what I understand, it seems like he hit Spinner before Shoji hit him. I could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong, by the way. So, um, oh, what was this? Go to China or fight Sun... Have you read the chapter? Go to fight or sun fight... Uh... Oh, right, okay, for God of War. Okay, I will come back to this, actually. I'll, I'll come back to this. I'll come back to this. Um. Anyway, so, boom, right? Spinner defeated. Shoji in the air looking like Deku. 
wink nod remember all the way back in the villain hunt forest anyway villain forest thing i, I can't believe i'm forgetting arc names whatever man but um, forest forest arc you know what i mean um uh what do you want me to protect with the with sorry, what do you want to protect with that giant body and scales of yours? Tell me, Spinner. He probably didn't do that, but you know. Um, you guys too. What do you want to protect with those amazing powers you have? I look and you're having flashbacks of um Aoyama. Aoyama's really hitting everybody, isn't it? Um don't give in to your wounds because then your children will be the target next, which is true. Which is very true. That's actually spitting facts. That's 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 very uh, honestly. That is straight up facts. <laughs> like, that's uh, straight up facts. Because let's be real here. With when, when that's why. Like, uh, I want to go on a whole tangent. I'm sorry. I have to go on a tangent. I'm sorry. This 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 BLM arc is lit. Because if you think about it, right? You know, this is why I always tell like black people. You shouldn't give in to the stereotypes because if you do the same thing over and over again. People will generalize you and your kids, and your kids will learn it too. So it just doesn't break the cycle. You're just in the same position. You know what I mean? So that's why I'm like, bro, we need to do better. Like, that's why, like, I'm Nigerian. And one of the things I hate the most is when Nigerians go, um, when something's not working in Nigeria, they'll go, oh, but it's Niger, it? And I'm like, what do you mean by it's Niger? Do better, bro. Like, go fix it. Go be, go be better. Like, I hate that thing. Kratos taught us better, right? In it, he goes, "Don't be sorry, be better." But anyway, so that's why seeing this, I'm like, "Yeah, man!" Like, like the cycle of hatred will definitely continue unless we change as well. So it's a two way thing. But anyway, um, I love this arc, by the way. I'm sorry, this is, this is a lot of stuff you want to talk about that I'd love to talk about. Sorry. Um, anyway, so he goes, "Don't give in to your wounds, because then your children will be the next target." And he remembers the girl that he saved. If I hadn't almost dro- if I hadn't almost drowned, then your face would have uh, become so scary. Aww. And he goes, "Don't let revenge consume you, please. Hatred will never disappear," which is true. Unfortunately, it, it will never disappear. You go, boss. He goes, "If the heroes win this, nothing will change." Said, "Oh wait, oh oh, is that Spinner that said that? Oh, that's sick." Okay, 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 I get it. He goes, don't let revenge give you the disease. And then Spinner goes, hatred will never disappear, which is true. And he goes, if the heroes win this, nothing will change. This is a call to action from that night. I love this back and forth. I love it. He goes, even if we stay hidden in the shadows, people will still spray us with pesticide. <sighs> Man, I'm sorry, I have to go on a tangent here. Yeah, again, Spinner's right too. Because do you know what it is? Like... We tried. <laughs> Sorry, I know I'm relating this as a black man. I know I should be trying to relate this more to the to the creatures, but I'm just like looking at this. I'm like, yeah, man. Like, spin is kind of right too, because it's like, damn, man, they tried, <laughs> and and st- stuff is still bad. So hatred will never go. And unfortunately, I hate to be real, like the R word. It's not like it will ever like vanish into thin air. You know what I mean? Like discrimination will always always be here always and this discrimination with skin will always be here unfortunately the question is how do you diminish the effects and how do you reduce it and how do you make it less that's the aim because me i've kind of given up on abolishing it man there's always going to be a white person that's going to call me a monkey it is what it is but we how do we make sure that less white people do it and more people understand that there's a consequence for doing that that's the question so yeah, but anyway, this is this is lit. I'm sorry, I missed a lot of these comments. Um, hold on, I missed a lot of these comments. Let me let me finish this chapter first. I'll get to the comments. I'm sorry. So anyway, they pay us with pesticide. If they attack us, we strike back, comrades. Raise your voices and follow me. Spitter jumps. Boom. Shoji goes. He's even stronger than now. My attack can destroy even. Wait, hold on. He's even stronger now. My attack can even can destroy even concrete. Damn, stronger than concrete. Woo, what kind of armor is that? Jesus. How is he moving so well? Okay, anyway. So, civilians are looking around. The civilians are marching. Shoji's like, oh, no. And they're like, they're getting fired up. There's no end to this. If they keep it going. And they're marching. They're marching. Where are they storming? Ooh, ooh. Spinner looks so cold in this panel, man. 
I know you can't see his face. He looks like a literal monster, but he looks cold as hell. I can't even lie. So he's climbing up this building. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, he's climbing up this building. Or he's either pushing a, open the building. I think he's pushing open the doors. Maybe I'm tripping. But yeah, it seems like he's pushing open the doors. doors. So anyway, Kurogiri must be at the research tower. When you reach him, play a recording of mine or Tomura's voice. Kurogiri's quirk will end this war. How? <laughs> how, AFO? How? <laughs> how? <laughs> I want to know. <laughs> anyway, they march in. Patience Tower. The hospital. Oh, 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 look at all. Oh, oh, no. Look at the whole ward standing together to block it. They're basically like, kill me first before you get through. That's deep, bro. Oh, my hero, man. Anyway, um, this, um, and that's a creature too. A creature holding, a okay, I see what they're doing. I see what they're doing. Because a, uh, 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 what, heteromorph, sorry, I should use a different word. A heteromorph is holding hands with a human and they're also trying to protect the hospital. So the heteromorph, there's a heteromorph, another panel on top of the penguin looking heteromorph or is it a chicken? I think it's a chicken. And he just was like, oh, actually... This is kind of mad. Like, <laughs> are you sure we should be doing this? They're actually kind of cool with that. Morphs. <laughs> so Spinner goes, oh, somebody goes to Spinner. You will become a hero for Tomura's space sake. So that's AFO replacing that to Spinner's brain. Is that Spinner shouting? I think it is. Ah, the, the pig uh, civilian is looking. He's seen some um, heteromorphs help and helping one another. They're looking around. And then me thought I'd always be nobody. But if me reach you, me become someone. Oh, look at Spinner. Shigaraki, look. How, look how much people follow me. Oh, no. See, uh, I'll say this at the end of the chapter. Oh, no. Oh, oh shit. I'm scared that Spinner's going to either die or just become a monster. Oh, Jesus. Let's, let's continue. Spinner looks back. Shoji, Shoji's voice has reached them. Spinner looks back. And he won't be your trump card. Oh, God. Who's coming there? Present Mike. Looking. Kuragiri! And he goes, Shirakumo! The two of them tried to reach him. To whom will he respond to? Stop. What a cliffhanger. Bro, this chapter's mad, right? But uh, what I wanted to say... Okay, actually, let me get to your chat. Let me get to your comments first before I actually say anything. Let me get to your comments. So where did I stop? Where did I stop? I stopped at the God of War comments. So God of War comes on birthday. I remember that. Da -da -da -da. Egypt, Egypt, Egypt. Okay, cool. F China to fight um, Sun Wukong. That would be dope as hell. Honestly, there's gods in every culture, bro. Even African gods, bro. Go Kratos can be fighting gods for a minute. So... <laughs> Don't worry, man. I think God of War franchise is here to stay. Um, Monkey King. Yeah, I can't wait for that. Um, oh, well, I hope they do that. Hurry just called her an ordinary girl. I can't pronounce her name. I remember he, it was... Um, wasn't wasn't there a, a, a drawing he did? Her, Nagan, and they had different names. Lady Nagan and something. I forgot what it was. We got God of War and Black Panther. Bro, it's mad, isn't it? It is mad. Next week is wild. It's like a nerd's wet dream. I'm not even going to lie. Um, these kids are the next generation of heroes. Hands down, 100%. And that's what they, that's what this show was setting up. Like, they, That's why they always are like, oh, this class, hey, they're the best we've ever seen. Woo, this is a special class. Because they know these guys are like uh, the top tier. But, um, but those kids, the ones below, I hope they hype them up because... Let's say my hero does get like a, like, I don't know, a spit off or somebody carries the legacy of Horikoshi. I would want those kids to be definitely more powerful than Deku's kid, Deku's gen. So, yeah. Um, those kids from pro license exam are teens. Will, uh, as teens, will bust out uh, stuff, adult Deku and other. Bro, literally. Literally. One of them had a flipping cannon at like, what, four or five? Bruv, they're actually broken, man. <laughs> they're actually broken. I swear, I swear it takes Yairozu ages to make something that similar, bruv. Like, <laughs> they're broken as hell. Um, so this is a Quirk Awakening from Koda. This is the thing. Quirk Awakening is a very weird subject because if it's like that, then every time a Quirk expands, it's awakened. But what it is to me, and especially how the show illustrates what quirks are, is that they always say that quirks can be expanded on, it can grow. Maybe the quirk that has been 
that was written as one thing could be a different thing. So I can't really say it's awakened. I can just say that Quirk, that um, Coda has just learned how to use his Quirk better. Does that make sense? It's like with Bakugo and his extra, like with more con his more condensed burst, he just knew how to use his lipids and better like not lipids but the sweat i believe the glands better he knew how to mold the use the glands to to mold the sweat into smaller more condensed forms of bursts i mean that isn't an awakening to me do you know what i mean that's just i, I mean correct me if i'm wrong but that's just what how i feel um he hit he has spinner from the side okay thank you thank you for explaining that because i was a little confused and that makes sense uh he might hit spin on the side Koda's about to summon some mythical Japanese bird deity. I would love it if the final, like, the final arc, Koda just summons, like, a dragon. He he goes, I can call anything, anywhere, even if it's not real. Here's a dragon. <laughs> um, Koda Bob looking kind of, bro. <laughs> um, I play these idiots like fool. He plays everyone like idiots, bro. He's just, uh, uh, AFO's just moving people like chess pieces. That's, what, that's his whole game, man. He doesn't care. Ayo, hey, what happened to Spitter with that thong? With that thong? Where? Which thong? Where where do you where do you, where do you go that thong, 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 thong? Where? Which part of the chapter? Spitter with the thong, 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 thong? I don't think I see it. Did you see the panel with a gun? Uh did I see a panel with a gun? Oh there! Oh right. Someone got popped. I forgot about that. Holy crap, someone got popped. They even said the bang bang. I didn't even notice. Wait a minute. Whoa, who got popped? Wait, wait a minute. That's actually a very big thing. Who got popped? Like, <laughs> who, 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 who got, what? Uh, I, we'll have to find out. Mass transportation, where? Um, where? What, what, what are you on about, David? What are we on about? If I please, and if. if uh, yeah, I'm a bit confused, but oh, 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 okay. I, I see what you're saying. So Kurigiri will mass transportate everyone. Okay, I see, I see. And you're right. You're probably right. Because if I am AFO, I transport everybody out. I bring back all of Twice's clones and I let them do the job. <laughs> I go, heroes, good luck. And I bounce. <laughs> I would have been like, that was the warm up. Here's the real fight, you know? So that would be funny. Um, Maybe that's probably what it is. Maybe Kurigiri is going to bring all the Twice clones. That's probably what it is. Um, but that doesn't make sense actually because Koga could use the twice clones. Hmm, maybe Kogiri brings Koga and Toga twice clones and just takes over, maybe something like that. Because those twice clones have to come, they have to, they actually have to come in this arc. Because there's no point of showing me that thing just before this arc starts and not putting it in this arc. They have to come, they have to. Anyway, anybody can be discriminatory, it's not just white people. I agree, bro. Nigerians are our are, word too. Nigerians are discriminatory to their own race, bro. Like, it's it like, bro, everybody is discriminatory to everybody. So it's not just a white thing. It is, a, it is an actual problem in general. It's just that it's so obviously, like, it's not obviously, but I would say it it's um, not worse, but how do I describe it? Because let's say, okay, let me be real. Let me be real here. And just, I try not to be too controversial. White people have always been the most popular race because they made the world like that. So when white people are racist, right, because white people have a lot of power and because they have a higher standing, unfortunately, like I said, I'd rather not have this be the case, but this is just how it is right now. If they're racist, a lot of hella more people are going to follow them being racist at those same people compared to, let's say, if a black person was racist to a white person, not really that many people will go and follow them to be racist. I mean, uh, well, may okay, that's a lie. <laughs> Every black person probably would. But other than that, yeah, not really all the other races will enjoy them. Does that make sense? I don't know if that if that describes if if that gives you a sense of what I'm trying to say is that because white people are such big authority figures and such big big presence and power that's why a lot of people are black fighting for BLM and all that you know what I mean I mean I know what you're saying you're basically saying hey, everyone can be discriminatory and you're right it's just that it's more prevalent clearly in like communities like the like that aren't that aren't white like you know what i mean it's more prevalent that's why we're all like hey can you stop being racist please like you don't really hear a white person say hey can you stop being racist please it's more it's more the other ones so um that wouldn't dictate to kind of find you know the doctor kind of find, bro i won't lie the one next to the penguin in it bro i won't lie i won't lie she's kind of looking like noggin can't even lie kind of like the nurse is Thai red yes Thai red I, I know it's tired but i'd say Thai red yeah chapters amazing chapters amazing balls uh yoshi doctor yoshi doctor i love the yoshi doctor too he looks like a chicken kind of to me 
Harry loves her tits bear. He does. He does. Look at everyone following me. No one behind him. When I heard the look at everyone following him, I thought he died. But yeah, no one's really following. Maybe he got shot, you know. Maybe it's better that got popped. But we, with all that armor, do you think Mike got popped? Oh no. Do you think Mike got popped? Uh oh. I hope Mike didn't get popped. That would be peak, bro. That would be peak if Mike gets popped in front of Shirokubo. And that's the way you wake up Shirokubo. That would be peak. Jesus. Uh, I would like Shirokubo coming back, to be honest with you. Honestly, me neither. I, I would rather have Kurigiri. But it would be, but I have a feeling Shirokubo is kind of, kind of, somehow, somehow coming back. Either he's going to be like Kurigiri, still Kurigiri, but Shirokubo is always attacking him. And they're battling between which one's in control. And at the end of the story, Shirakuma becomes Kurgiri and dies, maybe. But yeah, I know, I know what you mean. Uh, Spitter be breaking my heart. He needs a happy ending playing video games with Chiggy. That's all I want, bro. The Spitter turned from I want to follow Stain to Chiggy's genuinely my friend and I want to help him. Like, it's such. That's why seeing all this happen to Spitter is so heartbreaking, bro. Especially with the MVA stuff. Too bad they cut it out of the anime. But anyway. Um, Kratos doesn't need to fight African gods, lol. You don't think so? I would love it if, they, if Kratos fought some African gods, bro. I would love it. Imagine him going to Niger and fighting like a Yoruba god, bro. Dude, dude, that, we're all, bro. He fought elves, man. He can fight African gods. Let's do it. Um, and for this bit of dirt, he did it dirty, dirty. Um, also, that hospital scene was just so good. I hope they do it justice in anime. Oh, you mean this? Yeah, man, they're, they're gonna. I feel like, right? I feel like from the praise they're gonna get from this season will make them motivated to make season seven just as good, at least. And if they just make season seven just as good, I'm okay with that because season six has been banging. This is it's it's it's. I'll admit, yeah, it's not. It, it can be better, of course. I mean, bro, I'm watching Chainsaw Man, and that animation is like some of the. I can't even explain. Like, it's it's ridiculous. It's it's actually borderline unfair. How good the animation is in Chainsaw Man. So obviously, it's not like my hero is the peak animation, but it's still like what we got is pretty amazing so far. Well, well for season six. So yeah. Um tongue like uh, tongue like the thing in his mouth. When did he have a thong in his mouth? When was that? Wait, did I miss it? Did I miss him having a thong in his mouth? A thong in his mouth. A thong. In his mouth. I don't remember seeing... Okay, yeah, you gotta tell me what page that was. I can't see it. It is... Oh, 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 a thong in his tongue. Hmm. A thong in his tongue. Unless I missed that. Unless I missed that. I don't know why I can't see a thong in it. Hold on. Oh, his tongue... Ew. His tongue is out. I don't know if there's a thong in it. It has some scales in it. But, um... But I don't know. Um, Air Force tired of getting dog walked by the 16 year old. No! <laughs> Imagine you're an anime villain, right? And you have all these master plans. You're like, I'm going to take over the world. And then everything's going so well. And next thing you know, bit by bit, some of your villains are getting defeated. Some of your plans are falling. You're just like, what the hell's happening? And you just see this 16-year-old kid beating your villain's ass that you've trained and paid hella money for. That would piss me off. Like, really and truly, I'm like, at least be like 30 or something. Damn, this little munch kid just be bro. Spider Man, I think that's why Spider Man villains must be pissed off at Spider Man. Man, imagine you're fighting Spider Man, you just hear all these jokes, like, oh, uh, swing it around. Huh? How's it hanging? Nah, man, I would just, <laughs> I'd want to kill his, I would want to kill him too, man. So, yeah, <laughs> um, sh you're speaking too much luck, chick. <laughs> Too much logic, I know, right? No, I will not speak logic. I gotta be like the Twitter cesspools. <laughs> the cesspool that is Twitter. Speaking of Twitter, man, how's everyone enjoyed that? Because, boy, Twitter's been wild, man. I mean, wild as in weird because of Elon. I don't know what he's doing up there. Also, people holding hands are probably dead or injured since Spinner got past them. Oh, no. That's very true. They only show... Oh, no, they're probably dead. All they showed was the people... Then Spinner! Oh, they're dead, man! Oh, they're so... Yeah, they're dead, bro. They are gone, bro. He definitely no-mooed their butt, bro. 
Yeah, that pro that dead, bro. That dead spit a charge through. Oh no, look at the puddle. It's just the whole white. And you just see the group. Oh no, I think that dead, bro. Yeah, that. They are using guns against mutants, not Spinner or Mike, since they're already inside. I thought, let me see. Because when they got in, I don't think they were inside by the time the gun got shot, though. That's why I'm wondering if Spinner got popped. You know what I mean? I could be wrong. I could be wrong. It could be, like you said, that would be actually more realistic if, like, all the police start firing at, like, the creature, the oh, Jesus, the heteromorphs, and then that like relates more to like base. That's basically what happened with BLM. That's basically what happened. Is the protest the same thing? So they're gonna use that and be like, see, they don't care about us. They're shooting us. Finish them. Like this could be a sick. Oh my god, Horikoshi could be in his bag with this culture, uh, this heteromorph story arc stuff, bro. Really and truly. Um, it was likely one of the police firing that gun. So, uh, so I'm guessing that shot was targeted towards one of the civilians. All right, that would be also cool. Even if, if you pop one civilian, one civilian being popped is just as bad as all of them being popped. It's it's peak. It's it's really peak, man. That starts a war. That, that does. So I'd rather see Koki come back because he's gone. Uh, he's gone since like season two. Maybe Shirakuma has one moment before. Uh, but her Koki needs to come back. I agree. I think Koki should come back over Shirakuma, but. I don't mind Shirakuma coming back as long as he dies, man. I want him to be dead, man. I, I, bro, he's dead already, man. Like, why are we bringing him back to life so much? He's dead. He got flattened, okay? Bro, let him rest. <laughs> let him rest. Also, multiple shots are being fired. Multiple, yeah, it's true. You're right. Bam, bang. So you see what I mean? Okay, okay, yeah. You're right. So it's probably the civilians getting popped off. You're right, you're right. Um, also, I don't want to play Kratos while beating down my OP. <laughs> You've got a point. <laughs> That's a very valid point. I don't want to beat my own people with Kratos, bro. Kratos is going to rip their heads too. Nah, man. Bro, let's do that for Zeus them lot again. Let's not do that for my brothers and sisters, man. Oh, man. So, um, what was the thing I wanted to say about Spinner? So, there's something I wanted to say. So, um, yeah, I think I wanted to say that... Um, oh, now I remember. It seems like the villains, the League of Villains, every single villain is going to end in a very unfortunate way. Like, I don't think any of the villains are going to have a happy ending, man. Like, it seems like... Because already twice has died, right? Twice has died. Um, I think Dabi burns himself up and dies. Um, it seems like Spinner... Like, look at what's happening with Spinner, man. As much as I want him to come back to being normal, I wouldn't be surprised if he dies, man. I wouldn't be surprised if he dies in this arc with this armor. Because if you think about it, his whole existence was... Well, not his whole existence, but his main purpose recently has been like, let me help out Shigaraki. Like, I love this dude. Like, you're my friend. You're my bestie. Let me help out you and your group. I love this group. Like, you know what I mean? And obviously he's been discriminated, but he's not being discriminated in his friends. And they're going to be like, let's kill all the people that are going to discriminate you, mate. So yeah, he has a lot of love for them. And that's his thing. He's meant to be that. Um, he's meant to be the, the glue of the league. So him dying would be so detrimental. Like that, that is the league's downfall at that point. I mean, yeah, they'll take over at all, but they won't like... Shigaraki, I don't think Shigaraki will really feel at peace, you know? Like, twice isn't there, Magda's dead, twice is de sorry, twice is dead, Magda's dead, Compress has a chunk in his body, he's probably gonna die soon, Spinner dead, like, Togo will probably lose her, I think Togo's losing her quirk, man, so Togo's probably gonna lose her quirk, and then that will internally kill her, Spadabi will burn up, you know what I mean? Like, look at all these unfortunate situations, and it's sad because we actually like the League of Villains. You know what I mean? So that's why, like, seeing Phyllis, Spinner's downfall, it's heartbreaking, but he's a killer. He has to die. Like, you know, he has to, he has to pay. So, yeah, man, it's sad. Um, <laughs> Kurgi needs to be used as a weapon against AFO. A hundred percent. I hope, that's why I want Shigaraki. I need Shigaraki to, to start, like, taking over from AFO and start, like, like using the people to fight him. Kurgi is definitely one of them, a hundred percent. The police talking, um, uh, Talking, say that there is no end to this, and then saying if they keep this up, then and the next thing you see is a gun. So the police are using guns against mutants. Yeah, man, it's it's sad and it's stupidly realistic because that's literally what happens. <laughs> that's literally what happens, man. Okay, it's one oh seven. I have to bounce. I'm not gonna lie. I took a bit longer than I usually would. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Um, so next week is a uh, Black Panther review god of war um i don't know some god of war content 
My Hero Video, of course, that's going to happen. Ooh, okay, yeah. My Hero Video, of course, is going to happen this week. My Hero Video is going to happen next week as well because of the anime. Um, if there is a break, it seems like there is. Um, according to, let me just double check. Uh, Tink says there's a break. I believe you, but let's see. Next week break, yes. So no live stream next week, unfortunately. I apologize. So instead, I will do that podcast episode, which I promised you guys. Um, the reason why I've been delayed, not delaying, is more because I want to like get it ready. <laughs> I want it to be good. So um, I'll let you know, check the community tab. I'm not going to drop that on Friday. Actually, should I drop that on a Friday? I might. I might drop that on a Friday. I was thinking of dropping that actually on Monday, but maybe I will give it do it on a Friday. Actually, that makes more sense. So look out for that on Friday. Actually, instead of my hero stream, uh, but it won't be at twelve. I will. I will let you know. It will. It definitely won't be at twelve. And um, if anything happens, because I might have to do an errand because there's some family situation that's happening. Basically, that's why. That's why. I'm, like for the next like couple of weeks, I have some family issues and stuff. So that I have to deal with. Right? Not issues. Sorry. Basically, I have to help out with my family. Right? Um, for the next several weeks. So if I can't do it, I'll let you know in advance which day I would. But if it was on a Friday, it would probably be Friday at like six p.m. my time. So I'm looking like or six day. So it would be like eleven day. So, um, yeah, but that's just for that episode. We'll talk more about it that time. When it comes, we'll talk more. It's not for now, it's for later. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel for more pop culture and entertainment. I love you guys for coming. Thank you guys. Thanks, Tig. Thanks, Tyler. Thanks, David. Thanks, Flo. Uh, thanks, Oreo. Um, I feel like I'm missing some people. Thanks, Madman. Yes, I can't forget Madman. Uh, thanks, uh, Coiz. Of course, Darth Deku. Thanks everybody for watching us live and not live. If you're watching this on a pre-record or recorded, um, I look forward to seeing you soon. I look forward to more content. Ow, I just hurt my hand. <laughs> and um, I guess I'll see you soon. All right.